Hello my shining stars Aquariuses, I hope you will enjoy this drone flight and your horoscope for April 2024. We started month with retrograde Mercury in your house, three house of ideas, communications and sources of communications. I dedicated a special video on my channel for your zodiac sign. From April 5th to April 29th, Venus, the planet of love, harmony, money will enter your house three and it will bring you money for previously done jobs or anything connected with communication and your house of ideas. Your marketing business will flourish. You will have financial spring in the area of communication, transportation and education. On April 8th, we had solar eclipse in Aries and new moon in your house 3. Maybe you received an idea that it would be great to start your business with your vehicle or any source of transportation, or maybe you were started or graduated from educational cycle. It's a very special time when Sun and Chiron once per 50 years align together in your house 3 bringing you full transformation especially if you board on this train the number of cyrus of the solar eclipse 139 and more information i placed in my separate video dedicated to solar eclipse and chiron eclipses happen every year in the karmic nodes and they have different cyruses for Aquarius's karmic nodes in 2024 and 2025 are on the axis of houses 9 and 3. House 9 is the house of expanding of the horizons, education, justice, publications, trips to the foreign lands and traveling. And house 3 is the house of mind, house of ideas, education, transportation, logistics, siblings, and your closest surrounding like roommates. On April 19th, Sun will enter Taurus into your house 4, house that governs our home, place of living, pregnancy, news regarding our parents, family roots, safety, security, and when Venus in the end of the month will enter this house, it might signify some expenses for upgrading the comfort of living. Same day Mercury retrograde will meet Venus in Aries in your house 3. You might receive income and money from old projects. You might dare to revisit the places where you've been before and have short trips. You will have an opportunity to get rid of old items or junk that you don't need anymore, but be aware of con artists or bad realtors. Do not borrow or lend money during this time. In house 3, the conjunction of retrograde Mercury and Venus will bring you second chances to your old ideas or ideas of relocation, second chances to become a driver, social media manager, marketing manager. You will be successful to write or brainstorm information to change your occupation for taxi driver or logistic or repairman. This corridor of eclipses is a very unstable time. Be flexible, alert, adaptable and open-minded during this time because some unexpected changes and opportunities will appear. On April 20th, Jupiter in Taurus will meet Uranus in Taurus in your house 4. The conjunction like this happens once per 84 years. The alignment combines the expansive and optimistic energy of the planet of gifts, Jupiter, and revolutionary influence of Uranus. There will be transformative events in the realm of your fourth house that governs home, house, motherhood, conception, family roots, comfort, and safety. Avoid the places and the situations where you might be raped or violated because presence of Algol star adds a complex layer to this alignment. Algol, known as a demon star or head of a demon, is associated with intense and potentially disruptive energies. It symbolizes violence, upheaval, and darker aspects of human nature. The monsters of the past could be defeated and transformed or to be released and become totally out of control, like a beauty and the beast moment, or when the mother nature is not happy. 
it's a powerful kundalini energy and whoever has this conjunction with all gold star in their birth chart have to be very cautious and careful i have a separate video about all gold star the news about unexpected pregnancy can change your life and the decisions that you will choose during this corridor of eclipses will set the algorithms for the next 18 years house 4 is also house of landlords places of living apartments real estate opportunities please be cautious and open-minded and flexible on April 23rd, full moon will be in Ophiuchus in your house 10, in house of your status. This full moon will be a spotlight when emotions will be at highest and it will be a focus on potentially powerful changes in your environment, your goals, achievements and everything connected with your official status. House 10 is your public house, your reputation and your public image. If you were working at something for such a long time, it will be time when the results will be attracted to you. It will be the time when you will attract your most powerful emotions. That's why it's very important to know how with the meditation to get rid of some negative emotions. Afeyukas gives power of snakes. With one hand you can heal, with another hand you can kill. What do you choose? is the time of opening the new gifts, discovering your hidden talents and the possibility to transform your reality with your mind. On April 29th, Mars and Pisces will meet Saturn and Pisces in your financial house, house 2. And this will be a short window of financial opportunities for re-evaluation your views and obtaining the courage to protect your boundaries or your possessions with your own powers. Saturn in your house two for three years limiting your resources, so don't think that you can earn much. But when Mars in Pisces will meet Saturn in Pisces, this alignment will give you opportunity for increased income or gaining the ideas that in future will bring you lots of money is the time when you can plant your first intentions as a seed that will bring you fruits a little bit later after saturn will go in aries in 2026 on april 29th also venus changes the sign and enters taurus that it rules and it enters your house full venus and taurus is a very powerful ruler and it can bring you money love pregnancy, harmony, beauty in the house of motherhood, citizenship, land, everything connected with roots. Maybe you will sell house with extreme profit. Maybe you will win something that will give you opportunity to level up your comfort or for many Aquariuses, it can mean the new citizenship or the development in the areas of gaining the new PR or citizenship or relocation. If you didn't know your mother, it will be time when you will discover information and you can find your family roots or you will have opportunity to have a wonderful and pleasurable time with females in your family. Usually house for its females, it also can signify parents. Maybe you will celebrate having a party, some weddings or baby showers, or you will resign some documents. It's a busy time for people who owe business connected with real estate, legalization processes, documents and land. On the April 30th, Mars enters Aries. The ruler is very powerful in its sign in your house 3. When Mars enters Aries, you have to be very cautious driving a car because it's increased traumatic season for you, your siblings and your roommates and neighbors. Mars also can bring an open conflict, but it's good for competitions and athletes. Avoid fast speeds, avoid extreme sport and any risks because Mars in Aries is a traumatic combination. Avoid firearms and weapons and in house 3 it means transportation, relatives, logistics, short trips, 
vehicles education maybe also it can be the the shooting class and your first firearm but my recommendation when you have combination mars in aries in your house three it's better to avoid people with firearms it's amazing time for car repairs so whoever has the business connected with car repairs will be very busy people it's a great time for communication business and contacts and relocation because Mars brings energy, good luck to people who are ready to fight their fears and to become active in their communication in the house of mind, house of ideas. House 3 is the house of expansion of your contacts. It's great for collaborations, photo shoots, any creative adventures. If you applied for citizenship or PR cards, most probably in the end of April, you will receive the verdict or some news regarding the development of your applications. Aquarius is you are the most creative zodiac sign and with your powerful creative energy, you can alter your reality and attract the abundance that you deserve. April is a powerful month to implement your intentions and to obtain the hidden knowledge to improve your life and your living conditions for better. I wish you to have wonderful April. If you like this video, it means a lot to me if you comment and like. I hope to see you in my future videos. See you soon!